Hi, I'm Paul Kapinga, live from the WB SIP in Miami, Florida. What I'm going to show you is I want to demonstrate the ilioinguinal nerve block under ultrasound guidance. The first thing I'm going to do is take the transducer. What I'm using right here is I'm using a linear transducer and I'm using the Zonal 3000 MSK ultrasound system as well as a model. So what I want to do first is I want to identify the ASIS and I want to get the right angle. The angle is extremely important for this, uh, for this procedure. So the ASIS, what I want to do is angle the probe towards the patient's belly button. So ASIS and the belly button. That's going to be my angle. If I drop my probe on this, what I'm going to see is I'm going to see a beautiful image of the three muscle bellies that I want to visualize. You can see them here. Let me point out the structures. Go ahead and zoom in on this. It, it just come closer. Yeah. Is that good? The three structures we're seeing here is uh, I see three muscle bellies. This is the external oblique, the internal oblique, and the transverse abdominis. This is the ASIS, and you can see the bone, and I get all that shadowing right here. Between the internal and the transverse abdominis, I see this structure here. And it's not really important to identify the actual nerves, although here we can see them. They're right here. But it's important to identify the fascial planes between the inverse, the internal, and the transverse. If you come over here, so here's our target on the ultrasound screen, and you can note the angle of the transducer. It's coming off of the bone and angled towards the belly button. The needle will then be inserted in long axis view right here, and you can see on the ultrasound screen, let me get my image a little bit better. You can see on the ultrasound screen, if I push where the needle would insert, you'll see the upper left-hand corner of the screen where it would come in. You place the needle tip right in this area and go ahead and complete the injection. This is the ilioinguinal ultrasound-guided nerve block.